guitar was a way for me to express my feelings. I know how frustrating it is to play a guitar that's difficult to play. So it, it makes me understand and have empathy for others who are out there struggling through playing their most basic chords even. And they have no idea that their guitar isn't set up for them. We all met at Buffalo Brothers Guitars, probably, well, 15 or more years ago, maybe. Came down from Canada, got in at Buffalo Brothers, and James and I were like the, the guys in the back doing all this stuff. I had experience before, but it was awesome. Jay's smarter than he wants us to think he is. <laughs> He's been working on guitars and other string instruments for for years, just like just like me. His knowledge of, of vintage instruments, uh, especially with within the bluegrass realm, is really great. Bob is such a great player, and he's just so good with with people. He cares so much about the shop and what people think coming in, and Jay's a little more, you know, laid back, and so there's this balance that happens. I don't know what I would do without Jay and Bob. We recently moved to a 3,200 square foot building, and this is where our new shop is at in Oceanside, California. We're really excited about the new shop, and we've just been very busy, and it's repairs off the hook. I had no idea there's this much repair in the world. <laughs> the new shop is super clean. It's like a doctor's office for guitars. Going from 1,100 square feet to 3,200 square feet is just, it's awesome. We have room. <laughs> we have room to breathe. We have guitars in our inventory uh, that are for sale, and it's fantastic. When people walk in, they'll walk into the to the front of the shop, which is where we have all the guitars displayed, and uh, where we do all of our our customer service. We have a nice waiting room too. We're guitar players here. We know how they should feel, and we know how they should sound. My name's on the building. It. It has to be right.